The latest ridership figures are in for the MBTA, and for the third month out of five, we've seen ridership go up despite the fare increase that went into effect July 1st. What that means is that ridership is way higher than the T expected. Uh, planners for the state thought that ridership would drop about 5.5% after prices went up last July 1st, and instead what we've seen is that they've either held steady or raised about 1 or 2%. The one place where they've really dropped off is the ride, which is the door-to-door -door service for the disabled. They've dropped about 20 percent. But on subway, light rail, green line, trolley, bus, uh, ridership is, is either pretty similar to where it was last year or a little bit up in many cases. That's a reflection of many things, the economy, gas prices, choices people have, and uh, also a reflection of the fact that the T had not raised prices for five and a half years uh, until the fare hike July 1st. For the Boston Globe, I'm Eric Moskowitz.